it is me and my team. And I know exactly what you're thinking. No, this isn't some forgotten Tea Together Tuesday video. This is April 20th, 2020, and it is snowing. Like, snowing. So I think Mother Nature is about 19 days off from April Fools, but this is a great April Fools joke nonetheless. I'm very glad I have my warm mug of tea. And of course, a very happy Tea Together Tuesday to everyone once again, although I'm pretty sure I won't be uploading this video today, seeing as how the roads are an absolute mess and I can't get to the library. And one moment, please. Sorry about that, I had to dry off my camera because it was getting snow on the lens, so hopefully that is better. But it is again, once again, Tea Together Tuesday, and today's lovely prompt is what tea product do you have from a small independent company? And that is this lovely mug right here. This is from, this is my absolute favorite mug, and it is from the lovely little company, Sarah Ramix. And you can check out her store on Etsy. I will have a link down below. And she made this lovely mug for me a few years ago, and I absolutely, positively love, love, love it. And the tea that I am drinking, I'm going to do a quick review today because my question has been answered rather quickly. So the tea I am drinking came from this beautiful, beautiful set, and it is English afternoon tea. And this is the traditional English tea sets from the New English Teas. It is a UK company, and I actually found this tea at TJ Maxx. I was super thrilled because normally it's about $13 and I picked it up for seven and in it, it has 72 bags of tea. And sorry if the bags are a little crinkled right now, but it has English afternoon, Earl Grey and English breakfast. And this, this tin is just so aesthetically pleasing for me. This is from their Victorian reproduction theme and they have different size tins and I am so thrilled I was able to pick this up. I was wanting to get it for such a long, long time. And I am just so thrilled that I was finally able to pick this up. So far I have really, really enjoyed the English afternoon tea and the Earl Grey. The English breakfast wasn't exactly to my liking, but it was still, it was, I will still drink it. I will put some honey and some cream in it and it will make a lovely morning treat. So quick review on this lovely little gift set. I absolutely love it. The tin is incredible. I cannot wait to put other teas or tea knickknacks. Sorry for the car going by. That's, that's what the risk you take when you film outside. But anyway, I absolutely love, love, love this tin. And I hope that everybody has enjoyed this lovely snowy tea together Tuesday. Excellent April Fool's joke, even though it's a bit late for that. And everyone, cross your fingers that the lovely apple trees that are just right there, that the blossoms will survive this cold snow and this cold weather, so that later this fall, hopefully there'll be apples. Like I said, finger cross. Actually, there's cherry trees, peach trees, and apple trees full bloom right now, but they're covered in snow. So, like I said, fingers crossed. And everybody, I hope that you have enjoyed this Tea Together Tuesday together. If you're interested in joining in, just use the hashtag Tea Together Tuesday so that we can all find each other. And what is your favorite tea product from a small business? Leave a comment down below. And have you ever tried this fabulous tea? Let me know what you think of it. I, I'm hoping to get some more tins of this soon because I love these tins. Well, everybody. Thank you so much for watching me ramble on in this snowy weather. If you're interested in watching another video, go ahead and click right there. And if you are new, welcome to my channel and go ahead and click that subscribe button right there so you never miss my videos ever again. Thank you so much for watching everybody and I will see you all later. Bye!